Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to teach you how to make some really awesome apothecary products. I have a friend who's getting married soon and I thought for her bridal shower she'd really enjoy some nice relaxing um, bubble bath and also some bath salts. Today we're going to be making a peppermint lavender um, bubble bath. Super, super easy. Two or three ingredients. We're going to be making rose bath salts with real rose petals in it. And it's not only smelling amazing, but it also looks really beautiful too. So let's get started. So to start, we're just going to need a few different items. We're going to use a mortar and pestle, dried rose petals, a really cute jar, rose water, and kosher salt. You can also use Epsom salt for this, or any other salt works. I use dried rose petals. I feel like it works better. You can crumble them a lot easier. So let's get started. First take your mortar and pestle and add the rose petals to it. You're going to crush them up into tiny little pieces so it incorporates with the salt a lot better. You can use your hands for this as well. To add a little bit more hydration to these petals, um, I added some rose water, and you can get this in the ethnic food aisle in, the, in your grocery store. Um, I've also seen it at little Mexican rest, not restaurants, uh, little Mexican shops as well. So you just mix that together, and I don't know if you can see it, but the rose is actually turning the rose water a really cute pink. our jar to measure out how much salt we need. So grab your kosher salt, shake up the box a little bit so you can break up the salt, and add that to your jar. Then you're going to add that to your mortar and pestle. You're going to incorporate it with the rose petals and the rose water. This is the messy part, <laughs> but it smells really, really good. add the rest of your salt and finish mixing. Then all you have to do is scoop it into your cute jar of your choice. I got this one at Target, but you can find them at thrift stores and I think it makes a really cute gift. Next we have a really, really easy um, recipe for this bubble bath. Um, all you need is lavender essential oil and cast oil soap. I have the peppermint kind, but they have a bunch of different flavors as well. Um, add a few drops of your essential oil to your jar. I used about 10 to 12 or so. Um, and then I also add the cast oil soap. This stuff is so amazing. It really foams up well and um, you can use this stuff for anything. To add a little bit more of a deeper scent, I added some bergamot oil, but you don't have to do this if you don't want to. It's really tailored up to your preferences. Then I filled the rest of the jar with water, and seriously, that is it. It was super easy to make, um, inexpensive, and a really cute gift. Now you have this beautiful homemade gift for your mom or a friend or even yourself. I think I'm going to make this again for myself. Um, I really enjoyed this and it's super easy. Thank you so much for watching you guys. I hope you really enjoyed making these beautiful and super simple bath products. If you guys want to see some more of these, give this video a thumbs up. Give me a comment down below and subscribe. Also find me on Instagram and Twitter at Tiffany Fajin. So let me know what you guys think and if you tried these out, I'd love to see some pictures. So have a great day. Thanks. Bye.